Hello, my name is Chris with LobbyBox, and today I'm going to walk you through on how to add a member with security role and how to add an admin with the security role as well so they can log into the LobbyCom application. So once you log in, come down here and click on members and it'll direct you to the members page. As you can see, we currently have one member. I'm going to add another one. So we click on add member. And you need to enter in all the information that's required, which is phone number, first name, last name, and select the access level for this person. So we enter our phone number. Enter your first name. And then we select the access level for this person. So we click on intern as the access level. And then we click save. After clicking save, the system will automatically send a text message to the phone number provided for this member. They'll be able to download the mobile app and set the password for the mobile app. From here, we we'll go to company admin and we we'll add the, these two members as administrators for the account. So we we'll click on add admin, add in their email address. First name and last name. So since we only want to set this member up as a security, we click on the security role. And the security role only allows them to log into the LobbyCom application, doesn't, and it doesn't allow them to make any changes through the admin dashboard. So we click security as checkbox, and then we click the drop down, select their name, and we click save. After we click save, you see that this is their email, first name, last name. This person is not set up as an owner, and this person does not have full access. This person only has the security role. After we added this person, the system automatically sends an email, and they set up a, they verify their email address and set up a password so they can log into the admin dashboard, and they'll be able to log into the LobbyCom system. So we have one more admin. And this person is going to have the security role and we're going to have full access. So this person will be able to make changes for the admin dashboard. So we click the security member, select that person and we click save and the system automatically sends an email to this email address so they can actually verify their email address and set up a password so they can log into the admin dashboard and into LobbyCon. As you can see, it has the email address, first name, last name. This person isn't set up as an owner. However, if a member needs to be set up as an owner, then please send an email to support at lobbybox.com and we can move forward with setting that up. This person has the full access role as well as the security role. Now that this person is set up and have set up their password, we come over here to lobbycom, enter their their uh, email address and the password. We click on login and this allows a person to log into LobbyCom and they see all the visitor units that's associated with their company. All right, that concludes this video. I'll see you in the next one.